It's B-Rex back on Brex Talks. Hey, I'm at Wendy's Day. Anyways, sorry my hair is all messed up. Look at it. I had went and, I went and did legs. I guess that's why it looks like that. But I mean, I swear I combed it before I left my house. But you know what? Yeah, I, mean, I did legs. Let's see what I did. I did... Uh, hold on, man. I'm trying to get a better view in here. That, that looks like... Oh, uh, Sorry, it looks so crappy. But anyways, when I did legs, I did... First, I did sumo squats. You know, I usually do 10. Like, 10 reps. But I'm like, man, no, I'm not trying to kill myself doing those, you know. Because every time I do those, I literally, literally kill myself. And I have no energy to do anything else. But I do other stuff. So, I tried it with 5. So, I did... I'm just doing what I used to do, like, 5 times six like six sets of five so like i did a 70 80 90 five times 80 70 60 you know what and that that's real effective and it it still makes you tired you still feel it and i did leg press like that i mean more weight obviously but you know did sumo squats leg press leg extension and leg curls man i love the leg curls you know things where you lay on your stomach and you bring it to your like your back or your butt Oh man, I feel so good. But I can only do like 10 or 20 on those. Not very much. But anyways, man. You gotta do leg day. If you don't do leg day, what are you doing with your life? Huh. Alright, man. It's time to eat. I went and got the the Baconator Junior. Or AKA the son of the Baconator here. And Wendy's, man. Wendy's, their fries used to be, like, some of the best fries I ever had. And then, they went and changed them. I don't know what happened to them. Like, they're not even, they're just those natural cut fries. And they're just not that good anymore. I don't even get them. The only fries I really get are McDonald's, or Chick-fil-A, and Whataburger. Because, when I go there. But McDonald's and Chick-fil-A's fries are just, you have to get them. Well, not really, but McDonald's fries are so good. I'll get them. Yeah. But anyways. This is like the third Wendy's we've had in Lake Jackson, man. Like, there used to be one outside the mall, and there was one in the mall, and they took that away. And then we had, didn't have one for like 10 years. Now I built this one kind of away from town a little bit. But anyways, Wendy's, I used to come Wendy's when I was like in elementary school. <laughs> Look at Wendy. I think that was the daughter's owner, man. I mean, the, the owner's daughter's name was Wendy. That's why it's called Wendy's. Oh. Man, one thing about Wendy's hamburgers, man. They are small as crap. And you know, you go to Whataburger. Their hamburgers are like... As big as a wrapper. Like, they're huge. Look at that. It's like a freaking junior burger. Hey. But anyways, they have good bacon though. Yep. Wendy's bacon game is straight. Alright, man. Hmm. Wendy's have good Wendy's does have good hamburgers. Hmm. It's got bacon, cheese, two levels of meat. Didn't get mayonnaise or ketchup on it. Just meat and cheese. And don't worry, people. You can eat a cheeseburger like this. It's perfectly fine for you. Especially if you work out. You know what else Wendy's good at? They have great chicken nuggets. Yeah. Mm. But anyways, about lifting. 
you know, you can do five whiffs, like five sets on anything. And, like, I think that's what Nebraska used to use. Like, when the, you know, remember when Nebraska, like, football team, college was real good? That's the strength they use, the strength plan they use. Like, you go up three sets, and then you go down three sets. So, like I said, when I was doing sumo squats, I did... What did I say? I said 70, 80, 90, 80, 70, 60. You see where I'm going with this? And then on the leg press, I did. I mean, you gotta start light and then go up, you know? So I started on, don't, don't hate, but I started only on three plates, okay? One leg press. Only three. I don't know how much weight that is, but I know it's three. Not good at math. I'd have to count it up. So then I did four, then I did five. You know, five times. You know, I used to do that ten times. So I can do it. But, you know, why kill yourself, you know? It's hard enough doing five with weight like that. So, did that. Then I went and did uh, leg extensions, yeah, and then leg curls. So in the weight room, I've started trying to do four things a day for whatever body part you're doing. That way, you know, that's enough. You don't need to do any more than that. Four things, four times five, or five times six, six times five, whatever it is. It's like five times you do it for six sets, yeah. Six times five. You know. It's perfectly suitable. Ah. Oh, man. This is filling. Sorry my, my video looks kind of like blurry or it's like shady looking or not real. It's kind of like, you know what I'm saying? You know what, I gotta get a camera for, I gotta get a dashboard camera. Someone give me some suggestions on some dashboard cameras to get. Cause all I have to use here is a computer. And so, I have to carry my computer and bring it with me in the car wherever I go when I do a video. So, and it, it doesn't really fit on the dashboard so I'm having to sit it on the seat right here and talk to you kind of sideways. Hey man, it's better than nothing. You gotta do what you gotta do, right? By the way, happy Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day to all y'all. Oh, man. I think this is 500-something calories. You know, I really don't like dough meat hamburgers. But, this is alright. Because it's not too big. The reason I don't like dough meat hamburgers is here's what I'm saying. I don't like double the cheese. Like one layer of cheese is good, but when you add two, it just man, it takes away. It it just I don't know, it makes it nasty. Oh. Two meat hamburgers are so hard to finish. They are to me. I don't know about y'all. Uh, Baconator. I have to buy the Baconator. Hey. I'm not sad to finish this. Even though it's good. Because it's in Burger King. You know, it's not a Whopper. It doesn't have that amazing flame broiled taste. Ha! <laughs> but like I said, man. Their bacon is good at Wendy's. It's perfectly crisp and has that. And it tastes like they cook it in the oven. And that's how I like my bacon cooked. I don't know if you've never done it. But bacon cooked in the oven is better than cooking it in the skillet. For some reason, when you cook bacon in the skillet, it dries it out. So when you cook it in the oven, it cooks together at the same time. And all the flavors and fats and grease stuff cook into the bacon and make it kind of soft. 
and it's just a good texture and good taste. Yeah, and that's another thing. When you cook it in the pan, it doesn't cook all together at the same time. Half of the bacon doesn't cook, half of it does, depending on how hot the pan is. You know what I'm talking about? Some of it flops up, some of it doesn't. So, you know, it's just better to cook in the oven. Anyways. Oh, man! Go get a Baconator. Wendy's suggested. You can't go wrong with a Wendy's Baconator. Alright. Subscribe to my channel, Brack Talks. Hope y'all have a good Valentine's Day. I will see y'all later. Peace out, people.